now see, I kind of figured that, that the remaster was basically the pixel remaster level of quality or whatever. Added a few quality of life things, but nothing game changing. More storage space? Uh I really need to remove this off my playlist. It gets copyright claimed, I have to change it every time. Even though it does slap. More storage space. I don't know. I'll probably just stick with the original. Because I Got it for free with the disc. Um, we got a lot of cool games today. I really wanted to start Diablo. I just am not in the mood. If it works, you can't say no to the original. That's what I'm saying. And I played the first one. I played the first one and... I thought it ran fine. So I feel like I'll have similar results with the second. Plus, I just want to see it for what it was. It's like, I like remakes and stuff, but honestly, you just can't beat the originals sometimes. With so many games. I love Mario RPG, but the remake's coming out, and let me tell you. It's gonna be amazing. But I'll never look at it and be like, yeah, this is better than the first. But what do I know? <laughs> Just have to play the original now. Mario RPG? Can't believe Salt's considering playing the remake? Yo, no shade. I mean, he can play the remake, but like... He's just gonna appreciate- He's gonna like, appreciate the game way differently than we do, so like... Or then, like, like, Bosch and I do, for example, because, you know, we are, so, we're so nostalgically tied to the game, where he's just going to experience it fresh. But, I mean, whatever, man. Whatever he does, I'm going to watch. I just hope it's not when I'm playing the remake. <laughs> I'm excited to see him play Inscription, though, speaking of Salt King. Hi, Labelin! Welcome in. Without any nostalgia glasses for me as I go through, I'd give it an 8 out of 10 so far, but I'm still only at Booster's Tower. Wow! Well, I'm glad you're enjoying it. I wish I could see you playing it. It's just, uh, I just love the game so much. And it's such, it's a, such a simple RPG. It doesn't do anything uh, astounding or outlandish. In my opinion, the worst part of the game is all the mini games. The isometric platforming mini games are terrible. <laughs> they, they age like milk, dude. Like absolute milk. Yo, what up, Yovies? What up, young yub? I groan whenever a Mode 7 part comes out. <laughs> Since you're a streaming RPG Maker, decided to post a short video on your server to celebrate the occasion. But Labble and I always play RPG Maker. Yo, what's up, Bass? Vadix? 
I meant that you were streaming it today. Um, let's see. Mm -mm. Lablin sharing content here. There's always people posting cool stuff in here. So I appreciate all of you that are posting RPG Maker stuff uh, on my Discord. The R in Riggy 2K3 stands for I've always streamed RPG Maker games. I like how it's. Uh, do you have like pixel movement? Pixel. Pixel perfect movement or whatever. I made these tile sets recently. Very cool. Well, nice work. It's coming along quite well. Um, yeah. So, like I said earlier, I just was I was gonna play. I was gonna start Diablo two, but uh, I'm not really prepared to play it yet. I'm also just like in a mood today, man. I'm in a mood. I was excited to just get done work and, uh, you know, play some games. I hope that the game's able to end up in the bag someday. Not today, though. Not today, but someday. I think I think it'll be there. I think it'll be here one day. This is the 30th edition, which is crazy. That's a lot of games. And uh, thanks everybody who's been coming through and checking these out and, uh, and all the devs that have been sticking around. 30th must be a special day today then. Just crazy. So much content here. Um, how many games in total is that? Well, some of, see some, it's, every episode has at least two games. So a couple episodes have only been like two games because sometimes we get into one and then we play it for a long ass time or sometimes we'll have like technical difficulties but um i don't know i would say we've probably at least done 70 games by now right that's a fair number what's your favorite rpg game super mario rpg and it is uh somewhere in this yo chain links Hey, I'm not on loan, just dropping in to say hi and check out what game you're trying. Oh, thanks for being here, dude. Appreciate you. We're gonna start with one called Dead Velvet, which I think was made by some friends of ours. I think it was shared in, the art was shared in the Discord. I can't remember who it was. But we'll find out when the game starts. And then there's also a couple other games I've got lined up, so. We'll see, we'll see how we're feeling. But yeah, we played a lot of games We'll continue to play a lot of games, and, uh, I don't know. I just love doing these streams. But I hope everybody's good. Thanks for being here. Thanks for supporting the stream. Goodbye. <sighs> got, got Holly surprised by the dog. We're supposed to get some storms here, some like rolling storms and rain and stuff. So I'm just going to be listening in a little bit to it. That's probably better. Anyway, dude, let's, uh, let's check these games out. I'm still kind of adjusting to not having all, uh, all my homies in my house and being a little bit more present. So bear with me. There was thunder here early. One boom. And then I was disappointed. That's lame. I need like all or nothing. I need like, you got to give me the rain and the, and the thunder, or you got to just give me nothing. I say that. And then I just heard all the thunder. It's coming. Ooh, a horror. Yeah. I think this game's a scary game. But like slight, like I don't know how scary. If that's actually true. Let's see. Yo, what's up, Rag? Hope you enjoy it. Thanks, dude. That's right. That's right. This is Raganoxer's game. Uh, and you worked with an artist or somebody else, I believe, who I can't remember who it is. But I believe they shared the sprites before. 
Grimurix. Am I saying that right? Yes. Welcome, 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 welcome. My cat is half in my lap. Let me know if I need to cover his eyes. He's only three years old. He's a baby. I did the art and some music. Nice. Who did this title screen? You did animations? Yo, what's up, Sleepy Sage? Dang, y'all showing up. Thanks for coming. Let me fix my camera here. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Holly, anything you want to say to the people? Look how wide this is. Way better. Come here. Do you hear the thunder? If this if this stream cuts out for any reason, it's because uh, I think we're gonna, about to actually get hit with a storm. So bear in mind. I did the title screen. It wouldn't be too difficult if you could go to the fonts folder and install the custom font. If the text looks weird, let me see. Ba, ba, ba. Visitor. Oh, did it just change? Let's go. There you go. Um, oh yeah, and this is just the standard. Whoa. All right, let's check it out, dude. This is Dead Velvet. Hazel, talk to me. Finally, Hazel, have you made it to that place yet? I'm standing right outside, I think. I just got here. Great, get inside. How sure are we that this is the right place exactly? I don't want to barge into some poor mom and pop shop. There's no time for being exactly sure, Hazel. Asher could be in there. I'm sure enough to have sent you to do this in the first place. I'm sure enough to have sent you to do this in, in the first place. Okay, right, right. <laughs> I still can't help but feel like the cops could handle this way better. Cops have to get warrants. That takes time. Time we do not have. Fine. If someone like my little bro, little bro was even possibly in there, I'd not want to waste time either. That's the spirit, Hazel. Oh, I'm playing. Get this mouse out of here. Fuck off. Firearm rounds. Bomber jacket. Portable radio. Okay. Very cool. Can't leave. No leaving. I like the blinking. Did he blink too? Oh, what the hell? I don't have any change. It's impossible to make anything out. Door's locked. Register's empty. What is this music? Hmm. Backroom key. This is not for you, okay? I don't feel comfortable with a long hallway. You used your backroom key to open the door. Oh. Found a cassette tape. Hmm. Oh. Door's locked. Hazel, Hazel. Uh, hello? Oh my god, Hazel. Why haven't you been responding? 
This is the first I'm hearing from you, I'm sorry. Hazel, it has been hours. Hours? I'm pretty sure I only got in here a couple minutes ago. Hazel, seriously, don't try to mess with me. Not like this. I'm not. I'm being serious. Oh. Hello? That's probably fine. Hmm. Shit. Would you like to use a cassette tape? Oh! Oh. Let's see what's going on here. Cassette tape. Storage key. Uh oh. Uh-oh. I don't like this. What is that sound? Hello? Oh! Um... Oh! Okay. Yep. Oh, shit. I wasn't sure if it would be combat or not. Toy? Okay. Oh, a gun? Oh. I just wasted a bullet. Okay. This is very cool. Oh. Rounds. Oh, this is cool. What are you? What are you? Are you a thing? Nope. What are you? No, nope. A wasted bullet. Okay. Shit. Oh, it's really hard to shoot because of that. Yo, what's up, Sk Scott, squat, scat cobbler. What's up, homie? Whoa! Back up, bro. Mm. Squat cobbler. I'm an idiot. I got murked. I don't think the mechanic works here. You need a line of sight or something. And there's just like a, there's like a hesitation there that uh, I think you have to get used to because of the way that they the enemies move. It's going good, dude. How about you? Doing good, dude. Hope everything is well with you. Um, I hope to catch more of you playing DZ and Riggy. Got to wind it up. Oh. You can hold shift to delay your shot. Oh. Okay. Same. Get back to it. True that, dude.
Yeah, fantastic game. UPRC's magnum opus. <laughs> oh, I didn't equip the toy either, which probably would have helped. Yeah. I mean, I'm also using the, a controller. By the way, gang. What's this game called? This is called Dead Velvet. And the devs are here hanging out. Um, okay, let's kill this thing. Yo, like that. That was pretty cool. That was really cool. I held the button. That went pretty hard. It's on itch? Yep, I do believe it is on itch. And whoever would like to, please feel free to post the link in the chat. Okay, I got some roundies on my revolvey. Uh-oh. Very cool shooting mechanic. Uh-oh. Hello. Come here. You... Hey, Donut Man, you need to die. Three hits. Oof. Okay. So I'm just in some weird new place, new like this back rooms type place. How do I load? Oh, like that. Okay. There's a wheelie guy. Oh. Okay. Wait, what? Ariella, what's up? Oh shit, shit, shit. Oh my god, I don't know how I why I got killed there. Let's see. Uh let's see. I still don't have I don't have the toy yet. F true. I'm not fighting tactically enough for this. Yo, Aaron with the resub. Aaron, thank you so much for 33 freaking months. That's so, so sweet of you. And thanks for being here for the 30th. 33 months on the 30th. Uh, 30th uh, grab bag. <laughs> Nothing much. Nice. Okay, in we go. Wait, and then I'm going to go save so I don't have to keep doing that. Mm. I think this game moves at a pretty good pace. For the most part. Maybe one more save. Because <laughs> there's just this long hallway here. Or maybe there is one and I just keep passing it. Who knows. But yeah, thank you everybody for being here. I've had quite a day mentally, so it is nice to sit down and play some games. Shwink. Press and hold shift to aim and release. And hold shift. Okay. Heck yeah, dude. Come here, little guy. Come here. Come on. 
One more tile to the right, to the right, to the right, to the right. Oh. Oh. Okay. The. Oh, that's a little frustrating. But I mean, it is 2K3 combat. Because it can hit me there. It has a pattern, which is nice, but... Nice. Whoop. Firing is intentionally obtuse. Let's see. Oh, we didn't find this before. Found some medicine. You'll need to play strategically and learn patterns or just run past them. So it's not so much the firing I have an issue with. It's more so that the enemies hit you in, when you're when they're diagonal uh, tile. Ooh, hello. Because then it just allows a lot of cheap shots. But because you have to wait, I guess, for the process of firing. Ooh. But you can't really use... I suppose that that's a good thing. You can't really use... Ugh. Okay. I gotta wait till he do a move. Huh. Nice. Very satisfying though, for sure. Swing. Oh, hello. Oh, interesting. Okay, I see. <laughs> I like the transition as well. This thing's cool. Whoops. Shit. Blue gem. Oh. Enemies do have an advantage over the player. Think of games like Silent Hill. I guess I keep thinking that I have to kill them. What's your Twitch username? It's the same as my YouTube username. Whoa! See, like, that that's kind of stinks. Having a... Oh, hello. What are you? Oh, healing. Oh, yeah, so... Oh, nice. I have to put a... Uh... I have to put the one on my c controller. Would you like to use a cassette tape? Yes! Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's raining at this one. Hmm. Oops, I'm not experienced enough in 2K3 to immediately know how to make it work on a controller. Um, for for me, I just use Joy to Key. When I do, I, cause I just like playing old RPG Maker games on like a, the, my gamepad. Uh, but I'm sure there's a way. I'm sure Maniacs can uh, do that. And if not, uh, Easy RPG probably can as well. Oh, hello, Red Room. Getting a little nervous here. It's purple now. I 
just have to be more keen to my health. Is this gonna loot? Hmm. Oh, I wish I could cancel. It was me. I realized I can't load the gun after I've done it. Like after well, only I can only load the gun when it's empty. Hmm. Interesting path that we just took. Yeah. No. No. Oh, come on. Captured me. This is technically very impressive, though. You should be very proud of what you have here. This is the room where dreams come to die. There's not, not a lot going on here. It's very different from the last game I worked on, but I really much prefer this and working with Grimrix is a huge breath of fresh air. Yeah, it's very cool. Um, get me out of here, please. Oh. Cassette tape, thanks. I have two, I might as well use it. Oh. Oh, okay. A puzzle. Oh! Go away. get lost blame it was a very elaborate maze you cooked up <laughs> I like the wheel guy especially when he does that Wheel guy is cute. Any Wraith, what's up, dude? Oh, I hate when I do that. I can't. just wanted to be ready. Oh! Huh. Let's see. Where are we putting you? sure what I'm looking at here. Oops. Let's see. Hey, I killed that guy. Hmm.
Cool track. Oh. Time for sleep. Happy gaming. Good night, Chainlinks. Thanks for stopping through, buddy. Catch you soon. Oh, I fucking hate this place. I think I'd be more interested if they did anything. But right now I just walk. I walk this empty street on the boulevard of broken dreams. Where the city sleeps. You know what I'm saying? That's a lot of stalls. That's a lot of pot that's a lot of bathroom breaks. Imagine this many toilets going at once. This is infinitely loop. Have a great day or night. Have a great time zone. See ya, anyway. Thanks for being here. Uh, popping in here, dude. Okay. Something, something strange here. Oh. Whoa. Very cool. Oh, the map is unpleasant to walk on. Welcome back after meetings, Benny. Huh. This game is weird. It's like you may Nikki, but with guns. Definitely not your traditional JRPG. Yeah, true. True that. Hmm. I don't know where I'm going. This was the way out. Oh, wheel guy is in here. What are you doing here, you idiot? Bro. I bet, yeah, of course you're gonna move. Yeah, of course, now you move. Now you move, whatever. Okay. Creepy reminds me a little bit of Faith. Interesting. Armored vet. Oh, okay. Maybe it's not Faith. Faith, you just hold your cross and don't die. trying to pull a menu. You can't.
Okay, I still don't know what that means. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. no, not that thing. Why does this look different here? Okay. The, uh, which engine? This is 2K3. Cute pizza slices. True. Nice. Ooh. That's what I thought they were too, because of how fast they moved. But then the exploration reminds me of Yume Nikki. What? You're kidding me. Okay. Damn it. Hmm. Yo, Fix, what's up, dude? The Fixie? Damn. Not a key. Or a gem or whatever those things were. Yo, buddy, what's going on, dude? Everyone should download the news on the... Go That's download true. it right now. Go download it right now. <laughs> Thanks, Benny. Where the hell? I like don't. It's so easy to lose your sense of direction because these maps are so big. Oh, hello. Um, okay. I don't remember what it's called when, um... can just zone out into these Oh 
my god. Oh, it takes you, but it takes you into the. Mm. I see. Oh. What is it? A gas mask. going this is like deluge except you're not a skeleton and you're not in a deserted town and it's in ceramic hallways and you don't fight skeletons and you have a gun and a health bar and you're not lighting fireplaces and you have cat ears and you have limited ammo and chests don't play a cute tune when you open them uh, and it's not made by Riggy and it is made by Raganoxer and it's not called deluge but it is called black velvet and it's being played right now by Riggy but both games are great is this guy gonna hurt me? Probably, huh? Yeah, it's just like delusion except for all those things. Yeah. Ouch. Okay. Oh, you... I'm rocked. Oh. Okay. <laughs> all you need is a little bit of a... Uh... What's up, Illy? Check it out. It is, in, in fact, an Illy in the chat. Illy Beans of King of Grayscale fame. What does that critter do except be annoying? Illy on the beat, yo. Oh, I forget what it was, but Benny and I found something in Philly, I think. Or New York or something that was named Illy. I think. I can't remember what it was. <sighs> All critters do, do is be annoying and eat hot shit. That's what this one does. I might have taken a picture, but I'll have to look. It kills you, but you have the armored vest and gas mask combo going. Nah, it ain't, it ain't kill me for nothing. Cut me deep, man. Whoa. Oh, we needed those. Didn't we? This has got to be looping, isn't it? Maybe not. Can't really tell. A game like You May Nikki and Looping? Impossible. It's true. This, like, vamping music and just the sound of the footsteps could put me to sleep. In fact, I dissociated for about a moment and thought it was 8 p.m. EST. Like, this feels like mind control. Next thing you know, it's a 1,000 by 1,000 map. I do think it might be looping. Yo, Shadow Mario, what's up, dude? Jeez, indeed. Someone should make a game to help people get sleepy. It's a great idea. Maybe this is the game. Big maps tend to lag a lot. A snazzy tie. Oh. Hmm. 
This one doesn't lag so much as it just is very long. Oh, sh okay, cool. Two K three doesn't have as much going on, so I think it is a little bit smoother for large maps. I just bought Sorry We're Open a couple days ago. The same dev, dev who made Oh Sorry We're Open, the same dev who made No Delivery. Yeah, I don't remember if I played Sorry We're Open yet or not, but I love No Delivery. That's a really cool game, dude. I really enjoyed No Delivery. I I'd actually like to play it more because. Uh, I haven't had the best luck with it yet. Um, I made an edit of it to make it more fair. 2k3 is smooth until you have a lot of events on your map. Yeah, true. I've actually been fixing that in my other game, in my previous game. Ugh. Devil horns. Oh. These do not go with your horns at all. The battles in both games are too hard and you, d and you die more often than not as skills use HP. Right. Oh. Nothing? Oh, bastard, what's up? Fuck off. Bro, it's so slow. Roguelikes and RPG Maker. That would be a good thing to research. There are quite a few. And some games just have, like, little roguelike parts to them, you know? Hmm. Fear and Bunger. Fear and Bunger, dude. You're gonna summon DZ. Do I make Fear and Bunger? Yeah, honestly, that's it. Fear and Bunger. DZ and Riggy 3. Or just give DZ his own, his own game. <laughs> Excuse me. Fear and Bunger. I'm not really doing anything anymore, so I mean... I don't know if I'm going to be able to finish this one. Also got a game inspired by Oregon Trail made in VX Ace off Steam a few days ago. Still need to try it out. Though my favorite in that genre is DR D DR2C. I don't know. I think I know which that one is. Is Oregon Trail a roguelike death road to Canada? I see. Oh! Alright. Hmm. Interesting. Fear and Bunger. I don't know what it means. <laughs> Good. Perfect. Death Road to Canada is amazing. Oh, hello. Oh. Uh -huh. Tank top. Uh oh. They leave the eyes. Fear and Sugma. Never heard of her. Up spit. Wait, can I go else? Oh, okay. Strange bottle. 
I would like to save. I would like to save, please. What is the name of this game? This game is called Dead Velvet. And it is very interesting and different. And I have enjoyed it so far. It's just very slow. And, uh... Not really getting my juices going here. Whoa! <laughs> Mostly because it's a big, uh, uh, maze. With, uh, pretty empty hallways. Is it a play of blue velvet? Or red velvet cake? Dead velvet. Ah! I get nervous when I hear that sound. Gotta remember that everything is a freaking door. Cassette tape. Yeah, I think it's Grimerix's project, primarily. And then Rag... Raganoxer did the... Did a lot of the visual. I just thought the name that the name was so hard. It does go hard. It does. I think I would agree. I like it. Hmm. Okay, what's the deal in here? So there's a shopping cart. And then whatever the hell this thing is. I'm still miffed that the guy I paid to make sprites miffed uh, uh, dropped. I've miffed it. Uh, I'm still miffed the guy I paid to make sprites dropped off the face of the net. Yeah, what happened? It's pretty BS, dude. Hmm. Just pay me and I'll do it in 24 hours. There you go. This seems wrong. Not the not the business going on in the chat, but whatever the hell this puzzle is turning into. That would be wrong to put it there. Based on this game, I'd hire hire Ragnoxer. Yeah, it's very cool. Okay, you don't want to put it there. You don't want to put it in the doorway. Pay me and I will drop off the face of the earth too. At least you know that you'll be getting this time. Oh shit. That was a waste. You're, put, you're working on a remake of Mystic Quest? Oh, that's awesome. I love that game. I've always wanted to play through the whole thing. I've never done that. Oh, you beat Sifu last night. Nice job. How were you? Did you Benjamin Button? Or no? Shit. Did you... How old were you? When you beat it. Did you go backwards? Are you a baby now? Hmm. I think I was 70. Whew. First old AF.
This exchange without context is freaking hilarious. Whoops. Spit doesn't understand. Shit. How old are you? <laughs> That right there proves you're old AF boomer. Yo, don't call him a boomer. Don't disrespect Benny in the chat. Oh shit. Y'all can take the boomer memes and stick them up your, your boom, your ass. Odd future. No cussing for YouTube, man. That's kind of true. What the fuck do I do here? <laughs> Let's go. Wait a minute. Hold on. My dumbass. Go here. And go here. No. Go here. And go here. And it goes here. Okay. Okay. Oh, nope, doesn't have anything to do with the bread. Fuck. Thought I had to do with the fucking bread. <laughs> Cornbread is. <laughs> ah, cornbread is. Shit. Yeah, I think I think you're right. It is the flag. I forgot about the flag though. Damn it. The only flag I think about is the American flag. I'm sorry. Oh, shit. <sighs> Yeehaw. On the 4th of July, I just went about on my normal day. Yeah, you have to be here. He left already, so... Shit, what the, hell, what the hell do I do here? Okay, if it goes up, I get screwed. If it goes down, it hits here, this way, this way, this way, this way, this way, this way. Hmm. One. No. no music or anything it's just a weird like fan buzzing sound we'll make you say the pledge of allegiance backwards sure push it down okay down you nailed it. Okay. <sighs> Thank you. Slowly learned Riggy doesn't like when games have no music. <laughs> I'm just left alone with my thoughts, bro. There's the green gem. Okay. Where's the third gem now? Music's super helpful for atmosphere. 
Alone with thoughts, what a nightmare. Dude, I was today, and now I'm, like, super sad. I am a sad boy today because I... Whoa! I am a sad adult today because I thought about global warming. <laughs> so please no global warming chat. Talk in the chat because I'm angry about it. <laughs> okay, wait. So here's the next one. Oh. Now we just need whatever the other color is. Okay. Let's see. Where else could a puzzle be? <laughs> Yeah, you step there. You go away. No! Well. Okay. You wasted it, Rigoroni. I guess we'll do some more wandering. Shamefully, my most tearful goodbye was to a dog. Aw. I'm just glad to know you, fam. And I want to see Holly again. Oh my god, absolutely. I see what they're doing to me here. I see, I see. Hmm. Oh, you... Hold on. Hold on, dude. Yeah, Holly loved Benny. Oh, did the wall change? Hmm. Hmm. Um, oh, okay. All right. They're really yuming this Nikki right about now. Yeah, I would say so. Oh. Who up right now? Yuming the Nikki. I just have questions, okay? Oh! You son of a bitch. Hmm. Oh, there's a weight there.
Oh. Dang it. Bro, not even fair. Thinking of you, May Nikki. Yeah, just because it's got to do with all this wandering. Could never get through that game. It's hard. It's a very slow game. You have to be really patient and, like, able to just kind of do the wandering thing. I don't normally play through games like that. Because I don't have the patience. There's a lot of you, May Nikki. Uh, fan games and stuff, you know, just like Yume Nikki games. Got a 3D remake years ago. Yeah, and it was pretty bad if I recall correctly. It unfortunately did a pretty bad job. If you'd like a hint, the last gem is somewhere located somewhere near the Rainbow Room. No, that's super helpful. It's very influential and I think it thrived in the environment it was released in. Yeah, it came out in a time where I think it was able to have that impact. I would agree. Where was the rainbow room? Oh, here's the rainbow room. Hmm. Especially multiplayer. Well, that's like that feels like a resurgence now too. For sure. Because now it's like, now you can play with your homies. Which, we should do that someday. Oh, I didn't do this, did I? It's a vanilla cake. MMO Deluge win. That would be fun. It's a chocolate cake. Door's locked. Delusion would probably be a good game to do that in because it's only got so many maps to work with. Oh. Two medicines. Thank you. I feel like I'm missing something. What is this thing? Did I actually look at it? This? No. What is the word that describes the art of making candy? Confectionary. Yes. Hi, Morganite. Oh, ow. A cake key. <laughs> okay. Red gem. All right. Uh oh. We have bullets. How's your evening? It's off to a good start. I have been mentally feeling a little down. Um, but, uh, you know, I think it's just... I just needed to chill. And chilling with these games has been very fun. Chilling with RPG Wicker games is always fun. I just gotta remember where to put these. Oh, cool. Oh, I have no cassette tapes. 
Please be a cassette tape. Hell yeah. Hmm. Oh, interesting. And if I do this... <laughs> okay. That's the strat. Uh oh. Oh. Asher? I'm glad you're... Okay. Can you hear me? Asher, come on. Get up. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Alright. Okay. Hey, Mr. Toad. Just about to play Chrono Trigger. Oh, shit. Just about to play Chrono Trigger for the first time. That's an amazing game. Got really weird here. Uh-oh. What is that? Bugging out. Same with the sequel. That's one I gotta get back into. Have you thought about your place in this... Hazel? Did you find Asher? Did you find Asher? Did, did, that's the spirit, Hazel. Or the next five days, the vids in... Mounts to absurd 14 hours... Oh, pinwheels. Okay. I have to play Chrono Cross at some point. Uh, can you move? Thank you. Come here! Haven't seen another game using systems. That reminds me of uh, Parasite Eve. Oh! Parasite Eve I thought was, um, it was really, really cool. Oh god, damn. Yo, high taxes, what's up? Oh, there's an there's a code there. Twenty six sixteen five one. Okay. Hope somebody caught that. Just replayed Parasite Eve. That was one of the first games I actually ever streamed. And I'd like to play the, uh, the game again sometime. Maybe around Halloween would be fun. Oh! I didn't grab whatever the item was. <gasps> this is like a drug field nightmare. <laughs> Entire Chrysler building one stream? Yo, that'd be crazy. Wow. Aki, what's up? 
That was dead velvet. Holy crap. Very cool. Nice. Two, two, two legends. Very cool game. Seriously. Apparently Dave the Diver is incredible. I'll have to check it out. Sound effects courtesy of freesound.org. Nice. Definitely a play if you like Yumi Nikki and also guns. Yeah, I really like that. Do you think you're gonna... Do you, is that like the full game? Do you think you're gonna do anything else like this? Because it came out great. And it feels like it was something you pulled together pretty quickly. So, I mean, if you've got this kind of a talent, please make more stuff. <laughs> Forgive me, but... You made Blicky. <gasps> Hit him with the Blick. We've been thinking about it. We made the game in a week. Oh, no way. In a week. Great job. Yeah, definitely make something. Make more. You have something great here. I'm back at making games. Thanks to you guys. Kind words. And now with grammarics, anything is possible. Yeah, you guys should try and make more stuff. I will definitely play it uh, if you make it. This is for a game jam. Oh, very cool. Nice game. Thank you for sharing it with me. Actually, never mind the imager thing. I was a previous Caesar shift. It actually shifts to 61, 61 scissors. I have no idea what you're talking about, Aki. <laughs> But I hope you're well. Um, that was cool. What a nice start to the stream. Thanks everybody for being here so far. Um, that was really fun. The number code on the radio. Oh. What game next? Taxes, I'll let you pick. I'll give you some names. You pick one, okay? We can play... My friend really likes me? Uh, we could play, um, this Earthbound fan game, or we could play Living Playground, or we could play Deadly Woods, or we could play Veelta, if any of those sound appealing, I'll play them. For now, though, I do... I'm gonna pee. I hope everybody will consider sticking around, leaving a lurk, doing what they gotta do. Is Amord on the docket, too? Amord is on the docket. I think I got rid of it because we didn't play it from that bag. Oh, no, I still have it. Oh, we could play Amort. Taxi said... Can I request one? Perhaps. Melodies of life. Oh. I forgot I moved that around. Let's play this demo. We could play a Mort next. That's the name of the song. Melodies of life. I see. It's a very cozy track. Well, yo, give me a minute. Nobody go anywhere or I'm going to cry. Real tears. Real big, big boy tears. I just got to pee. It'll take two seconds. Be back. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Yo, you know this song? You know what this is from? This is from Hilux 2, baby. Yo, Mario, what's up, baby? You're so hot, brother. Mario, welcome, baby. Hold on, let me run this out. I don't know if this game's gonna be any good, but we're gonna try it. What was that? In my Christian Twitch stream? What are you talking about? Here's a funny game. Bro, taxes, you just sending it <laughs> you just sending a zip file. <laughs> How big is it? Blue sea and the blue sea. Oh no. Yeah, like, what the hell? So funny. I don't think that this game uh, is going to be all that technically impressive. I don't even remember why I downloaded it. It could be bad. The music that you're hearing, though, is from Hilux 2 and not from this game. Beeple, beeple, beeple. You played this? It's like Psycho no Sutoka for RPG Maker. Chuck Salabod type beat. I thought that was the point. Oh shit. Well, maybe we should see what it's all about. I love this track. Alright, let's stop that. And let's check out My Friend Really Likes Me. The game I'm working on now is pretty much malware. <laughs> That's my favorite way to introduce a game. Okay, this is My Friend Really Likes Me. Oh, I didn't turn the sound on. <gasps> Hello, welcome to our hotel. Would you like a room? You're just visiting your friends, so you're not going to be reserving a room, you thought. You tell the receptionist that you would like to go to your friend's room. Ah, that will be on floor 11, room 66. You can take the elevator as the stairs are being cleaned. Okay. Yo, what's up, Breath? Oh, this is a... Uh, oh, God. Okay. Wish to view the credits? Yes. It's Labyrinth's game! Oh, I that's why I downloaded it. <laughs> oh, Labyrinth was here earlier. Well, no kidding. Very cool. A lot of familiar uh, things in here, then. Labyrinth makes, like, these smaller projects that... Uh, are all really cool. Yeah, this is a Labyrinth game. Is this the elevator? Doesn't really scream elevator, does it? That that scream now that screams elevator. Oh, normal. You have six fit hits before you're taken out. Are you sure you want to play normal? Yep. Does it run smoothie on your riggy rig? It sure does. Oh shit. Oh no. Okay. Doesn't it? Oh god, oh god. My only suggestion for this would not to be free free moving camera. Because you can't walk, you don't walk freely. You walk on the tile set, which I know, I know, MZ3D, you can adjust. 
Like this would be cool as like a dungeon crawler. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's dark here. I like the music though. Y'all don't have barn doors in your elevators? No. Can't afford an elevator, I'm actually poor. Mouse movement? Oh yeah, it's a little bit easier with the mouse. I'm clicking and that's how I'm moving the, the camera right now. Not clicking, but like holding the click. Is this a button? No. What is that? Hello? Your friend's diary. Read it? Sure. Dear diary, today I've killed someone. Can't let my friends know about this though. <laughs> Should've read the diary. I'm gonna kill you. Uh oh. Oh shit. This sucks. I'm gonna get killed now. <gasps> uh oh. Oh god. Oh god. The elevator. I can't use it. I'm too busy holding the <laughs> holding the fucking mouse. <sighs> if only I could see. Ah. Okay. Just gotta get away. Get whatever that thing is. A key. Oh, okay. Now I just gotta find a door. Her line of sight is pretty tiny. <laughs> ah! I don't like the vibes in here. Okay, listen, lady. Listen, lady. Listen. Oh, it worked. Okay. I just see floor in Black Void. Is that the game where you had to run from a giant crazy chicken? What's walking? <laughs> I'm so confused here. Uh, gotta read that diary again. I think. I'm trying anyway. Yo, what's up, Adam? Welcome, dude. Uh, just uh, in this game, doing this thing. Not really sure what. Uh... <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Her line of sight sucks. can't see anything. I like the idea. It just needs a lot of work. I think she needs a bigger line of sight. Uh, you need light. Even if it's just like a dim light or something because it, this is just... I'm not really doing much. Hey! It's cute though. It's a cute little demo. 
It's your friend and they really like you. Think it's darker in the higher difficulty? Oh, I'm playing in normal difficulty. But like... <laughs> Let's see. Oh, right. Don't forget to take the elevator. Oh, my bad. Trying to use it on controller is brutal. Hell. They'll be taken out in a single hit. Oh my god. It's so dark. Giant chicken game chasing me. That would be fun to play as well. Though honestly, these chase games just make me super anxious, super freaking nervous. Dude. It's like green, it's so dark. Hell, see, hell mode was easy because it was only, um, it was, or normal mode was easy because it was blue, but now it's green, so it's hard. Whoa, let's go. <gasps> oh, God. Okay, go in the door. Good. She can't get me in here. In, at the toilet or whatever I'm wherever I am Giant chicken did nothing wrong meanwhile the player was some intruder trying to steal sensitive files. Oh, he's that so you're the bad guy Okay Are, are you winning I think so she stinks Chicken feet is like chicken blood, but well made. I see. What's up? <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, she's... That's your friend? Oh. Till I go read the book. Then she becomes a bad guy. In hard mode, you become besties with the killer. That's right. That makes way more sense. I've got some killer besties. <laughs> Um, you know, uh, uh I don't, uh, I don't know what I'm doing. Bre Brenda, remember when you tried to kill me? You are such a bitch. LOL. Maybe I should have played Diablo 2 today. I swear, I'm just looking for the... Diary. There it is. Oh. What? <gasps> oh. Now see, this makes sense. Look, I've got the light and everything. Even though it's impossible to use with controller. Ah! Oh my god!
fucker. That was mean. Okay, we'll do one more. Yeah, it just needs the controls. Too scary. It's too scary for taxes. Can't take it. Hey, what's up, girl? Hey, how are you doing? Glad you're able to come here. How to open the door? You want to leave? Don't leave me here. It's scary and dark. Nice to see you, too. Thanks for that. I was feeling a bit down lately. Bye. What? Is that your friend? RPG Windows Maze. Yo, I would play a game where you're in the Windows Maze. Trying to survive. That would be sick. Someone turned the maze into a PC game? Yo, I want to play it. I'd love to play that. It's free. I should like know the layout by now because I've walked through it so many times. Here it is. Today I killed someone. Can't let my friends know about this though. So they're all different, which is kind of fun. Door's locked. Uh oh. But see, why doesn't it give me the? It doesn't give me the the light. Oh shit. Windows maze back rooms. Gotta be a bunch of those on itch. Yeah, I know. You're probably right. Okay, stop chasing me. I s Okay. Fuck off. What's it fucking I can't see the door. Screensaver subterfuge. What the fuck? It's just a hallway with a table. Oh, that's the name of the one you found? Cool. I'll peep it out. Sounds like something worth checking out. Is this where I wanted to be? The bathroom? Love the bathroom. Okay. I, I maybe. Maybe. Hello? I think sometimes it just randomly spawns the monster behind me though as well. Sorry that it's so dark. You guys probably can't see anything. It's really not even like possible to make sense of the area half the time. It's the table. It'd be nice to find, like, a heal. Since you know I got sliced. Fuck you. Exits near the bathroom. So here's the bathroom. Oh. Whew. We win?
Don't forget to take the elevator. Okay. Is that the whole game? Yep, that's it. Well, there you have it. My friend really likes me. <laughs> Pretty cute game. Uh, needs some work. But, you know, Labyrinth's projects are usually short and pretty experimental, so I respect it. So, cool game. Nice. There was a good idea there for sure. I would agree. Let's see. Oh god. Uh, well, I don't think I can play a Mort because I can't get it to show up. Well, <laughs> is this RPG Maker VX? Do it. I love the... Is that Hylix I hear? It sure is. Oh, no, it's VX Ace. Why can't I get this in not full screen? F4? Okay, maybe Benny, we will have to play it another time. I actually make a 3D Zelda map in Ace with the use of a special script that has a 3D editor. Alt Enter? I tried that one too. It didn't work. Let me see one more time. You can like hear the music come in. Oh, there we go. Okay, nice. It was my poor timing. Thanks, homie. How do we start the... There we go. Title screen. Oh. Okay. Yo, this game. Rath, you know anything about this one? This one's got ZDS's hands on it. It's got uh, Benny, Benny's hands on it. It's got SB's hands on it. Pretty cool. Woo! And, uh, you know, I wanted to play this, but needed shit to get it to run. You needed the, the, uh, RTP for it, maybe? Tags. Dark Mystery Adventure. Benny is in the legendary Benny Makes Games. The very same. The one and only. Blessing us with another project. I've only really played a little bit of Benny's stuff, really. So it's always fun to see stuff that he worked on. But I think this one was spearheaded by ZDS. And um I I love that cuz ZDS worked on um uh, 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 a ghostly rose. Only played one thing by Benny. He's pretty low-key with the stuff he works on. It's true. He's done a lot of collaborative projects. Uh, and a lot of Game Jam stuff. Or, like, just event stuff. Pardon me. For my quick break there. Alright. Let's check it out. This is called a more. 
Lycia. Ly Lycia. Lycia. Aren't you being a tad irrational, Morgan? I swear, Lycia. I swear on my mother's grave. There is something off about the postman. I didn't want to let him in, yet I was afraid. In the 15 years she was married to Morgan, he had never once admitted he was afraid of anything. It's just the postman, Morgan. You're ill. You're not of sound mind. I cannot let him wait any longer. I'll deal with him myself. No, don't let him in. Lock the doors. Tell him to leave. I swear on my mother's grave, he did something to her. When her marriage to Morgan ended five years ago, he had returned back to our hometown where his mother lived. She died shortly after. Yo, what's up, Ten? Lycia had a suspicious suspicions for quite some time now that Morgan had taken the loss a little too hard. He's not the same man he once was, for better or worse. Just get some rest, Morgan. I won't let him in. You always had a keen sense of perception. Please, open your eyes. Do not let him near me. Just gazing into those beautiful eyes. What's up, baby? Oh, I'm playing now. Morgan, how has it come to this? Whatever happens, Alicia, do not let the postman near me. Do not. Okay. Ten, I hope game dev and life and things are all going well for you. We're having a decent Wednesday. Today's Wednesday, right? Yeah, hump day. Morgan's family, heir family heirloom. I wonder if I ever needed to use this myself. Hmm. Why the postman gotta come in anyways? Just throw it near the door and take a picture and get the fuck out. I farted. Nice. Morgan's mother, mother's books, book, what? Morgan's mother's book collection. Today's your Tuesday? Oh, hell yeah. Madame, I've waited long enough. I need to pick up my postage. I have a schedule. Just a little longer, sir. My ex-husband is quite ill. It takes him some time to get out of bed. Are you certain I cannot sign for this myself? I am sure. Morgan lost his sanity, but something is off about this postman. I feel like I've seen him before. No. Like I said before, it must be Morgan. Now hurry. Lysia noticed the postman's bag lying behind him. She found it very strange to why a postman would not carry his bag at all times. I have always relied on my keen sense of perception. I should not be afraid to use it now. Press down the P key to use a perception skill. There you can see areas of interest. Okay. Then I guess I cannot play keyboard on this. Oh. That's cool. Obviously, we have to get in there. On our, on our own. While I abhor intrusion, I fear a frenzy has overcome me. Let's see, I opened the postman's bag. This looks like this postman's bag did not contain any letters. Only human skulls. Morgan was not wrong about this man. I must hurry back and lock the door. If I leave now, who knows what will happen to Morgan. Should we just go talk to him? Should I, I should turn around. I do not wish to wish him to catch me sneaking around his stuff. A mort means spiritless or lifeless? Hmm. I think there's actually a black and white JoJo RPG Maker game. There is! Oh, do I, have to, I have to go lock the door. That's not... None of that is how you lock the door. Yo, DZ, what's up? I should keep what I saw to myself. Morgan is in no state to handle the truth of his paranoia. Hey, dude, nice skulls you got there. Lycia, do not let the postman in. Lock the doors. What the heck? Yo, hey, what's up, DZ? Hey. 33 haze in a row. Thank you. I love you. <laughs> Do not concern yourself with this post, man, any further. Just get some rest, Morgan. If he comes back, I must take the sword and... The sword. Press a P to use a perception... Oh, right, right, right. I think I asked you played the Barkley Shut Up and Jam Guide him, right? I did. I uh, uh, actually have... The streams are available. You can watch them uh, on my YouTube channel. I should grab Morgan's family heirloom, just in case. Let's see, obtain the family heirloom. In case I gotta kill the postman. Mother, don't let that man near you. Morgan, your mother is dead. What are you seeing with these clouded eyes? I think that was 33. Thank you, dude. Thank you for 33 haze. Uh-oh. The postman, his face. Oh! Postman emerged. The blade is in my hand. I must be suffering from frenzy. 
Once I strike, there's no turning back. I must be certain. My perception is keen. I must rely on it. Anyway, have you seen the Moss channel on the Discord? It's all inscription spoilers. <laughs> That's, you know... Uh, what, what can I say? Whoa, this is crazy. You succumb to your eventual fate preemptively. Prepare to be harvested. I cannot run. I must fight. Postman is strong but easily intimidated. He did not dare reach Morgan due to my presence. His strong scolding should destabilize him. Too many posts to delete. Yeah, Inscription is one of my favorite games of the past couple years. What's up, tidy whities? Much love to Moss, but holy shit, that's awesome. Wait, how do I undo? Can I go back? Okay, I can. Okay, we're gonna scold them. Nice. They're weakened now. Wow, this is neat. So, DZ, this game is, is called Omort, and it was created by uh, ZDS, who created A Ghostly Rose, but it was also worked on by Benny, uh, aka Cashmere Cat, and a couple other people. It's pretty neat. This is not good. Morgan will never forgive me. Lysio laughed. I can still use what's left to attack. I should keep it with me. Uh oh. <gasps> okay. Nice. Victorious. Cool collab. There's more of this place, more to this place than I remember. Part of me wishes to run far away and never look back, yet. I should really go check on Morgan. Sad the video on YouTube of the real ending was taken down. One you had to look at real clues in the game to find. No kidding. Uh, I began writing a letter to my children. I wrote in general, in great detail, of the dangerous postman and his bag full of human skulls. I wrote about how afraid I was for Morgan and I. I found a different sort of postman and had him deliver my letter. I thought I was writing to my children at the time, but in the end I addressed it to the sheriff. Perhaps I wish to make a difference. Perhaps I am mad. The sheriff had written back to me and asked me to meet him in the Coldflower National Park somewhat nearby Morgan's house. My instincts told me there was something off about all this. I had to take Morgan and run far away, yet I found myself making the journey to the National Park. It was broad daylight. No civilians were out and about. The sheriff stood in the middle of the frozen lake dressed in a civilian attire. I may have made a huge mistake. Huh. Greetings, Lissy. I apologize that we needed to meet under these unfortunate circumstances. It will all be fine as long as you help me understand the situation here. The truth. Standing in the middle of this frozen lake, Lysia felt almost naked. She wanted nothing more than to run far away, yet the frenzy was true and powerful. I remember when you were a child. I was a mere officer back then. You were polite and always stayed out of trouble. You and your husband Morgan moved south after you had wed, yet both of you had returned. May I ask why? Morgan and I experienced some difficulties in our marriage. He moved back here to stay with his mother, who had passed away in recent years. Morgan grew ill, so I decided to help nurture him back to health. I plan on returning home once he is back to his usual self. Your difficulties with the postman, it is most unfortunate. May you tell me in person about what you wrote to me in the letter? The postman came to see my husband, yet my husband is ill and could not leave his room. The postman insisted on seeing him. I noticed something terrible about this man. What did you notice, Lysia? He was no postman, for he only carried human skulls within his post bag. The man was dangerous and his face was deformed. What did you do to the postman, Lysia? Where is he? Lysia did not like the way this sheriff was glaring at her. She gripped her broken heirloom tightly. I protected myself and Morgan. That's all you need to know. Do you know anything about any killings around here? Is my sight, is my husband safe here? I do not know anything, Lysia. Nothing at all. Dude, I always get skulls delivered by my postman. You should have stayed far away, Lysia. You were never any trouble. Uh, are you implying that I what I think you're implying? Is that hole supposed to be my grave? You left me no choice, Lysia. I promise it will be fast and painless. I must stay calm. I need time. A little time. May Lysia uh, cleared her throat. May I have one last walk around the park? I don't see why not. I am confident you won't run. I assure you, I never miss my target. Running is not an option. The sheriff will dispatch me with ease. Misuse my perception is my only chance of leaving this godforsaken park. Huh. 
Is that a gun? What is that? Oh, a hole. I should take while the sheriff is not watching. I need to find the ammo. You're under arrest? Dude, this is a crooked ass cop. Cold wind. Oh. Y'all got any bullets down here? Oh. Coal in the crate? Sure. Huh. Oh. Something in the snow. Is that a bullet for the shotgun? I should grab it before the sheriff notices. Big fan of the black and white with the pixel art? Me too. Feel the draft? Uh. The vibe here is very cool. What about that? Should I pull the lever? No. Place the coal there, then pull the lever. Something appears to have happened. A lot of shaking up in here. This is great, I agree. What? In the blue hell? That's right. The lake melted and the sheriff fell in. Now is the time to strike. Tricked his ass. I bet you could probably fight him without doing the the ice and would probably be harder. His face. Also, oh, he's weird too. If I attack the sheriff, I should be prepared for his true fury. Perhaps I should use perception and observe. Okay. Hmm. Is that my shotgun, you vile woman? Wow, the sheriff looks like me when I get up for the midnight snack. I pity you, Lycia, for you cannot accept your fate like a good civilian. Prepare yourself. I do not ever miss my target. Oh, interesting. Oh my god. Blasted him. And I found three pistols. <laughs> the cold wind is strong and unsettling, yet I am burning with a sickness I did not know existed. The sheriff's body was destroyed by the impact of the shotgun. I could only stare at the second life I took. I remembered my home with the fondness over the years. I always thought life took a turn for the worse. Oh, hello. Took a turn for the worse. Uh, Mikey, what's up? Raiders, welcome in, y'all. We are uh, in the middle of a game called Amort, an RPG Maker game made by our friends ZDS and uh, Cashmere Cat, aka Benny Makes Games, uh, as well as a couple other contributors. But what's up, Mikey? How was stream? Uh, let me reread this. I remembered my home with fondness over the years. I always thought life took a turn for the worse, yet the good memories of this cold, distant place may have been nothing more than an underdeveloped sense of perception. Before Morgan, I loved another. It was a harmless teenage love. Often I look back at those times, deeming them amongst my happiest. His name is Robert. I hear he and his family take care of the old church. If, there, uh, if there's anyone I can trust in this godforsaken place, it's Robert. What's up, Mikey? Stream was good. We finished We Happy Few, and now I need to put my brain back together. Well, congratulations on finishing a game. I don't really know if I know what We Happy Few is, but I hope you had a good time, and... Um, I just love and appreciate you. Yo, what's up, Billy? Illy with the merge. It is nice to see a familiar face, Robert. You haven't changed a bit. It's a rare achievement for you. It is so lovely to see you again, Lycia. It's been ages. Why haven't you kept in touch? So much to catch up on. Sorry about that. I was not in the best of places. I did not want to burden you. You seem so happy with your family. Nonsense. We have loved to have you over for dinner. Robert told me all sorts of stories about the crazy things you do did as uh, kids. Robert's wife Gloria, she looks just like me. 
I wonder. We were the most boring couple of the whole village. Lysia laughed. What could he have possibly told you? No, seriously, it's great to have you here. I want you to stay for dinner. You can finally meet the little ones, Junior and Betty. Cute kids. Mine are all grown up. I wonder if I'll ever see them again. You have lovely children. I'd love to stay for dinner. Great. Do tell me. How is Morgan faring? I heard he was ill. Quite so. Lately I've been wondering if I caught whatever he has. The things I've seen, the things I've done, I need a friendly face to talk about it with. You can talk about anything with us. Robert and his family smiled wide and sent a chill down Lysia's spine. Do you know of the, the Blind Prophet's Book of Truth, Lysia? I do recall that. I do not remember much details, but I do remember that the religion was dominant in this county. Amongst the burning sea of human skulls, our one and true leader will emerge from the dust of the tainted. That is what the book teaches. Oh. We are the tainted, Lysia. It is our duty to donate our tainted bones towards a better cause. You never understood this. Not now, not back then. I fear that why you left, you claimed you had a keen sense of perception. No, what you had was a thick veil of delusion. See me for what I am? I am tainted, but I aim for a greater cause. You are disturbing me, Robert. What madness has gotten into you? The vision of glory is crisp and clear, Lysia. Let's have dinner. I know exactly what to cook for you. Feast upon the truth, Lysia. Our dear postman was tainted, but he was a true warrior for our cause. Dine upon his finest dish. What are you telling me to eat? You cannot seriously be suggesting human skulls. <laughs> you can use filthy words to describe the truth. It will not blind our clear vision. Take a walk, Lysia. Consider our offer. Have a nice warm meal with friends and family. Or you can just simply leave. It's your choice. He cannot seriously feed his kids human skulls. Am I li living a nightmare? Or has this always been true? I am gripping of the broken heirloom as tight as I can. The madness is spread too far within. Hmm. Let's perceive. Nothing. Oh, shit! I should think about what I'm doing before I'm at the point of no return. Okay. <laughs> Skulls, delicious. Ah. Skulls again? Oh. Wait, why can't I use it? Hello? Mikey Risa? Oh, Mikey. Time is an illusion. Mikey, thank you so much for 28 months. Appreciate you. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. Always, dude. Love you dearly. Appreciate you. Thank you for being a friend. Okay, we're not going to fight these guys yet. I should leave, but I cannot. There's something off about my old friend Robert. Right. We're going to go find out what. Oh, that's the ladder I need. Whoa. The music in here is really cool. I have to fight the entire family, that's right. I see a doorway to the attic of the ceiling. I can use the ladder here to climb. Okay. There appears to be a bolt cutter in this crate. Should I take it? Yes. I can cut the chain with the bolt cutter. It could be disastrous for Robert and his family, yet there's still something wrong about him in this church. Wow. Let's do it. Okay, once I do this, there's no turning back. I am submitting to my frenzy. Shit. Oh. I think my package is here. Holly moment. It's the skulls. Smoke is rising. I believe I started a fire. If I wish to see the truth, now's the time to strike. Let's go, baby.
Now they're angry. The fire is creeping towards the family. I gaze upon their faces. They do not have the eyes to see, for they are monsters within. What? Oh. To think, I once loved you. But even back then, I knew you never understood. Prepare to be harvested. This is as it must be. There's no turning back now. I must rely on my perception. I'm just gonna shoot. Actually, uh, uh oh, <gasps> that's it. Let's see if it was victorious. I'm a murderer. I'm standing within a sea of fire. The family of my teenage love are blackened and distorted, much like what their heart be hearts became. I do not know if I feel immense sadness or relief. I see nothing but corruption in this godforsaken town. Perhaps it is time to visit the mayor and get to the bottom of this. He may be the one responsible for this, yet he is old and weak. My wisdom tells me to take Morgan and walk far, far away from this mess. Yet as the fire raged around me, I calmly walked through the flames as if nothing happened at all. I am truly sick. When their bones are picked clean and the clean bones gone, amongst the burning sea of human skulls, our one true leader will emerge from the dust of the tainted. Dead men naked, they shall be one, and death shall have no dominion. He is the same man I once knew as a child. Was he always this way? The Book of Truth teaches many things, except what, who truly was the blind prophet. The dazzle of the lighthouse can hint to us, miserable, tainted, his true nature. Perhaps that is your destination. Hmm. I hastily left the mayor's estate. The man was clearly mad, yet he was not hostile towards, towards me. I do not know what to think of him. I found myself making the long journey east towards the outskirts of this rotten county. My destination was the lighthouse. I do not trust the old man, yet something tells me I will find the answers there. Your foolish frenzy ends here, woman. The light of my lighthouse will never guide you, for you have to defeat me to obtain the key to the light. Hmm. The man is a giant. There is no way I can battle this one, yet I fear he underestimates me. Perhaps I will give up then. Poke around all you want. There's nothing you can do. Uh-huh. So you think... But me, I love to poke. I think this contraption is some form of jackhammer. Should I turn it on? Yeah. There appears to be a hammer within this crate. Should I take it? Yes. Hammer three. Huh. Hmm. A broom. Yep, yep. Dynamite. Hmm. Hmm. Make him see the light soon enough. <laughs> Did I check this? Hmm. 
keeper of the lighthouse. I can barely look at him. His mere stature compels me to look away. Hmm, wait a minute. Hmm. Oh my god. Okay, can't beat that one. One shot. Sorry. Okay. Okay, so the dynamite we took. Was there anything else in here? No. So that maybe the support beams? Does is this guy just gonna chill while I just destroyed the lighthouse? There we go. Something happened outside. The lighthouse fell. I must change course in action now that I cannot use light to guide me. Hmm. Oh, look at him. Keeper of the lighthouse emerged. Oh, he's got two arms. The bottom half of his body was crushed. I would suspect he's done too pleased with me, but he remains emotionless, almost as if he was refusing to acknowledge me. Just blowing stuff up. Foolish woman, I will feast- okay, wait, are you gonna be crazy now? Dynamite is fly is a is a skill or is a nice skill. Okay. And the hammer too. Can you control my game scale? Yeah, I know how that feels. I found the key amongst the rubble of the lighthouse and the dismembered body parts of the giant. It was worthless now that the lighthouse's light would never shine again. I gazed upon the starry sky, light shine light shone towards my destination. There was no lighthouse, yet the sky was stained. So I headed for the border. 
The last ramparts before the wasteland. This is the border wall. The guards are silent, yet their swords are drawn. I do not think I would survive a battle against so many. I should find another way. What an interesting game. Oh. Kind of has buddy simulator vibes. Hmm. I wonder if there's a way I could get rid of the flames. Pull the lever? Yep. When will her rampage end? True. It grew damp and cold in the caverns. The fire's gone out. Oh, I brought the light back. He's not noticed me yet. Okay, so I can't go that way. Or maybe I can. Huh. She gotta go. I mean, he gotta go. Okay. Shit. Two of them. Uh oh. Uh. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Join the club. UPSC adding hard mode to his games. Oh, what? They're fighting me now. <gasps> okay. Mirror mode. No. Foolish intruder, do not step into my ritual, or else I will devour you. I need to be careful about where I step, it could be my end, unless I find a way to weaken him. Wow. Blind man. The darkness I see is truer than the tainted lies you see, yet you dare call me blind? Prepare to die. You're right. All text is reversed. That would be something else. The man is blind. I do not know if this will work, but bathing in this water may distort his sense of smell. Interesting. smell what have you done I cannot sense where you are perhaps you can come to me then I will devour you oh I'm gonna take all the skulls
Ah. Magic spell. The blind man emerged. I'm gonna throw skulls at him. Oh. I see. Think I'm not really doing any damage, am I? Shit. Yo, Effium, what's up, dude? I'm doing good, man. I'm just playing a mort, an old, an old game by uh, ZDS and Cash Cat. Among others. And it's been pretty fun. Pretty tough. Oh. I think the log is all silly. Anything else? Hmm. Nope, I think that's it. Alright. <sighs> I don't know how to do this. I mean, I can keep hitting you with the skulls, but I don't think it's doing enough damage. Blind man set the land on fire. Every single weapon I obtained is gone. What did he do? The flames shall consume you. Become one with the cause. Help me set off the truth. Grant the way for our leader. Lysia felt the fire creep under her skin. She choked and screamed. She choked to scream. The only thing she could do is be devoured by the flame. Lysia stood with the family heirloom in hand, no longer broken. You, 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 you are. I understand now. Prepare to die. Interesting. Sword reborn. Covers HP per attack. What the hell? I died. Now to put them into a mailbag. I know, I forgot about all that. Come on. We know how to do this now. Kraken collecting skulls. Okay. Run it back. Okay. So first thing I gotta do, willpower, skulls, no, come on, Right, here's all this. Don't care. Whoa, we got rid of it. How does it- what? The math doesn't work. Bastard, what the fuck? Fuck? 
I don't see how we win either. Like, maybe if I had ammo for the shotgun. <laughs> Can we leave? Right. Maybe that's what I do? Yeah, look, now they're doing four. Mikey Raid? Yo, what's up, Spectrum? Yeah, it was a Mikey Raid. What's up, dude? Fuck. Like, seven damage is huge. Oh, okay, I heal eight. Wow, that was close. Just worked out and made dinner? Nice, dude. I've just been chilling. We're playing some neat games. This is a game, actually, uh... Some friends worked on a long time ago. Before returning to Morgan, I decided to pay another visit to the mayor. Yeah, this was made by ZDS and Cashmere Cat, aka Benny Makes Games. Uh, and, and uh, a few other people. The mayor laughed. Oh. The mayor turned into dust. The frenzy called ambition consumed me. Your disgusting reign is over. Time to finish this. I returned to Morgan's house with sword in hand. He did not seem to notice I was gone, still crying about the threat of the postman. If only he would open his eyes and see what I accomplished. I finally wrote back to my children, telling them of my newfound responsibilities as leader of this godforsaken land. Morgan has not gotten better, and our relationship is still the same shambles it was, yet things are beginning to change around here. A mort. Nice! Oh, and Super Stroke. Concept Game Design and Scripting is Cashmere Cat. That's Benny. Uh, SB Concept Graphics and Mapping. Concept Graphics, Game Design, Battle Design, Mapping, and Music. That was ZDS. Great team! Very cool. Ooh. But yeah, if you are new to the channel or unfamiliar, Benny Makes Games is a great friend. Uh, he was actually just here visiting from New Zealand. I live in Philadelphia. And uh, we got to spend some great time together. And this was a game that he recommended me play. So I'm glad we could play through it. That was pretty cool. That was a mort. Sick. Cute little project. Boom, boom, boom. We're just gonna keep playing this track. Good game, good game. How we feeling, everybody? How we doing? <sighs> I think I might need a quick break. Uh, to grab some water, maybe a quick snack. Uh, and we could probably do like one more Maybe not even a sec. Maybe just play one more a break e2k3. That's right mm. Let's see yeah, quick breaky 2k3. And then we'll play. Let me actually pick the next game and then, then we'll take a break. We played this. We can play Living Playground. 
me see. Play this one. Uh oh. Sometimes you play you. Sometimes you load up certain RPG Maker games, and the window just it just completely tanks everything in your computer. Michael Bligel, Michael Bleichel Raid. Also been lurking. Hello, cuties. What's up, Bayburn? Welcome to the stream. Nice. I'm from the PNW. I'm not built for heat. I don't know what the PNW is. Uh, but yeah, I'm not- I'm- I'm, uh, not built for it either. Thank God for AC! Ninety three there? Oh, my God. Gosh, we have AC, but I had to go outside. Got ice cube trays, but my dad decided no ice was allowed to be made for them. Put coffee in it. When it gets hot, the ice maker in the freezer stops working. Um, Spectrum's got a nice uh, offer there. Hoping they allow me to get some sleep tonight because I may be up. I need to be up early. Go see the polar bears. 
What the hell are the polar bears doing where you live? <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> you can sleep in the bed Galax left in. Yeah, I hope that was a nice visit, Spectrum. Having them over. The Galax family. I should have a guest book. You're telling me, dude. You're telling me, dude. My my shelving, though... My shelves are filled with gifts and trinkets and things from friends. From all over the world, so... I'm cool with that. What's up, Holly? Is your treat? Your bone? Oh. Alright. This is called... Deadly Woods. Nothing. I can't see anything but plain white. I'm outside? Or inside? I don't know. Oh. This is me. I can see myself. Why am I smiling? A young woman appears. Comes closer to my face. I don't know her. She whispers something into my ear. I'm dead, but I still live within. I don't understand, but I keep smiling. Then it becomes dark. Oh. Whoa. Oh my god. I don't want to sleep, okay? I'm an FBI agent? That sucks. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> Just a dream. It seems that I slept in the office again. 91. Yo! FBI offices in the city of Sinfai Nocti. Cool maps. Cool sprites. <laughs> Hi, Special Agent Desmond. Good to see that you're ready to take on your next assignment. If you go through that door on the right, we can talk about your job. It's gonna be a murder case, my friend, so get your gun ready. The victim is a young girl named Sarah Anderson. You can read these files on the way to town. I hope that you like the slow life of small towns and pine trees, because you're going to see a lot of it where you're going. And we think that it may be related to Agent Parker's disappearance. So this case may be really important for the borough. Now, look sharp! Agent Parker was MIA while doing an investigation three years ago. Any information that you get on the topic will be valuable. Now, good luck, Desmond. Don't come back empty-handed! I never know what to say when ending a phone call that's not like friends or family. Do I say bye? Do I say I love you? Do I say later, loser? You have to go with what you're feeling, dude. Desmond, the president is a job for you. Go talk to him when you have some time. And stop sleeping on the job. You're going to get in trouble if you keep doing that. Okay. Hey, Desmond, I have some paperwork to take care of now. If you stopped sleeping on the job, I probably would have less to work to do. But I know you, my friend. And I know that you can't do it on... That you don't do it on purpose. So stay chill. Stay cool and go chill. Thanks, Angelus. See you later. Smell you later. Hey, Des. If you get some good missions on the beach, call me to be your partner. I'd love to some vacation from the office. No problemo, Mark. I'll remember you if I get a case by the beach. Okay. Table, there's some food in it. There's an image there that shows up. Something cooking, but it's not mine. Doesn't need to wash my hands now. They're very clean. I think I should take a quick I think I should take a quick bit. Doesn't hurt to be clean. Okay. Let's get sweat. Hmm. What should I do with my future? What? So many plans and dreams, but I know that I shouldn't get excited about any of it. Life is not fair. We'll break your plans like they're nothing. I just pooped. Y'all see that? I just took a little poopy. There's some food in the fridge, but I'm not hungry. AM flight to New Zealand it is. Can we do the flight a little later than 8 a.m.? Dawn of a bad day. Dreamville Town. Sonia and Sarah's house. I should go wake up Sarah for school. She's gonna miss class if I let her sleep so long. That bed looks empty, bro. Sarah, it's time to wait. Huh? 
She's not here, but where is she? Let's go find a nice spot to do some fishing. The forest is a perfect place to relax and fish in the morning. I just love the climate here, man. Okay. Huh? What's this? Is that a dead body? A dead body of a young girl? What just happened here? I should call the police. Hello? Please, put me on the line with Sheriff Tom. I need to do a report. There's a body, a body by the river, in the forest close to the school. It's a young girl. A body in the forest? Are you sure about that? What's happening to this town? I'll be sending my personnel in there to take a look. Wait. For me, right where you are. Uh, I may need to ask you some questions at the place. Okay, bye. Body of a young girl in a small and pacific town like this. What's happening here? I just go out there, give them a little spit charisma, scare the shit out of them, and then we're done. Three days ago, the body of a young girl was found close to a river in the middle of the forest in a small town in the USA. Her name is Sarah Anderson, 17, of the uh, Dreamville town. The town's in shock. The thing is, there have been a disappearances of young girls in the neighboring towns. Maybe there's a connection, and that's where I come in. My name is Desmond Miles, Special Agent Desmond Miles. That's what everyone calls me. I work for the FBI. Okay, bro, relax. My specialty are cases that they judge unsolvable. Maybe there's a serial killer, or maybe it involves the paranormal. It doesn't matter. I solve them all. I see, I see a mystery and I solve it! Here I am, Dreamvale outskirts. My car's out of gas. How amateurish of me not to fill it up before coming to the assignment. Well, I'll just leave it here by the road. My top priority at the moment should be going to the hotel in town. There's a room reserved for me and my equipment's there. Can't start my investigation without my notes and a map. I should just follow the road to get into town and look for a hotel sign. Okay. Uh, not sure if Quince is just a big Assassin's Creed fan. Is that the name of the main character? Oh, shit. Hello? What is that? Okay. An old one. Oh, that's cool. Had a dude propose midair before I look back and it was like, better say yes or I'm killing this shit. <laughs> Looks like a terrier. That's cute. Yeah, he didn't propose a spit. Forever alone. Oh shit, that deer. Oh my god, why are you chasing me? Small town dream veil. Okay. I like that cry, crying Bowser emote. Can't you see that we're busy? Yeah, they're making out. The store is closed. The bar? Bars are always open. Oh my god. Listen, only to your friends. I love coming to the club. I don't have all the time in the world, but I spend most of what I have in here. Some fucking moves down here. Do you like me? I like you more than anything I have in my life. Empty words. Oh my god. What? Let me just poop while they're making out. What is this picture? What do you call a magic door? A uh, magic dog. A labracadabra door. Hi, dear. How about you buy me a drink, huh? One drink and I'll be all yours. It's a good deal, no? Yes. Thanks. So what do you want to talk about? Romance. Try to kiss. Oh, you're so sweet. Come here. Give me a kiss. Nice. She stole money. <laughs> Just want to relax right now. Leave me alone, please. Uh, okay. Fedora Ninja? Can't my wife's in there. Relationships of the new age. Bro. Fedora Ninja is a good username. Hi, sweet. Five for a dance. 
I don't have five dollars. Escape the police too. <gasps> okay. <clears throat> this game is easy. Are those police or taxi cabs? They are uh, the DZ police. Oh my god, you just hit somebody. Caught you, punk. Oh shit. GTA 1? It's like GTA 0 1, or like 0. 0.5. GTA 0, the prequel. Okay, that's messed up. Bro, this game sucks. Let's play one more time. Because it sucks. The music is just slapping, you know? Fuck you! <laughs> Pardon. Sorry for my bad language, everybody. I just really was enjoying myself there. Okay. Thanks, Spit. Oh, it's raining. I grew up in a semi truck. Nice. Well, I must endure the presence of a few caterpillars if I wish to be acquainted with butterflies. <gasps> I love it. Another bar? I could buy a piece of pie at this bar. I like the Castlevania poster as well. You bumped when you should have jumped. True. True. How much was the pie? Way too much money. Diners close. What about 24 hour diners? I like living in the streets. You say a lot of weird things when you stay 24 hours a day under this blessed sky. Oh. Day afternoon. It's morning. We are all atheists about most of the gods that humanity has ever believed. Some of us are just go one god further. What the fuck? Huh? Sonia's house. She's only here at night. Sheriff Tom's house. He's only here by the night. Bro, what? How do you know this stuff? Hmm. Imagine affording a piece of pie in this economy. That's a good point. <laughs> it's a valid point you got there, dude. What are the doctor's doing out in the street? Good morning. Those who do not speak, those who, who's, those who know do not speak, those who speak do not know. 
The opposite of love is not hate, it's indifference. You talk when you cease to be at peace with your thoughts. It's hard enough to remember my opinions without also remembering my reasons for them. I like how it feels like a city, like an active city. It's pretty neat. Time is an illusion, that's true. Good morning. Those, oh, right. They all just say the same weird cryptic shit. Hello, Mr. Miles. I'm just breathing some fresh air of the morning. Nothing wrong with that. No, no. Keep doing what you're doing. What? Hello, you must be Desmond Miles. Your room is ready. It's the second door in the corridor. Bad is Castlevania 2. Hello, mister. Would you like to play a game of dice? If you win more than- yeah. You got five. You're so luck. Cool. It's my room. It's my favorite show, Similar Mountains, a series about mystery and friendship. I like the character art too. I like the sprites. That was cool. <laughs> okay. Personal computer. Rename save file. Nice. Block of notes and a cell phone. You can use the block of notes to see the actual objectives of your investigation. You can call friends with the cell phone. And there's a map! Okay, excellent. Should I poop? Okay. Uh, it's very interesting how humans crave attention, even when there's just no reason for that. We yearn for a sense of belonging. Jim's room. Solomon's room. I've heard that the FBI is in town. I keep asking myself what may have happened, but maybe weird things happen here all the time. Good day. Expect everything. I always say, the unexpected never happens. Oh, so this game's like a whole Twin Peaks parody. I don't know anything about Twin Peaks. Smallest minority on Earth is the individual. Those who deny individual rights cannot claim to be defenders of minorities. Okay, relax. Good day. The easy confidence with which I know another man's religion is folly teaches me to suspect that my own is also. Not your cup of tea. Yeah, that's... I feel that, dude. No shade. No hate. Oh man, just walking in the street now? I'm going over to the presidential building now. Follow me if you like. I don't know where that is. Yo, this guy just grooved into the American flag. Look at him. Move your body, man. You need to breathe deeply because the air of the morning here in Dreamville is good for the lungs. This makes me- this reminds me of like a Game Boy game. Like this would make a great Game Boy game. We're just standing here now. Or old DOS? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Motel? I must say a word about fear. It is life's only true opponent. Only fear can defeat life. It is a clever, treacherous adversary. How well I know. Happiness can be found even in the darkest of times if only one remembers to turn on the light.
Oh. Okay. Good day. You only live twice. Once when you were born and once when you look death in the face. Hmm. You know... Okay, I can go in here. You know, I'm an artist, but lately I've been a little uninspired. I don't know how I could get creative again. I'm just tired of drawing, because paintings are not that inspiring anymore. People just look at it once and get bored. I need to do something more than just putting an image on some white canvas. I want to touch people's hearts and make them feel. Maybe if I could find a muse, someone different. I don't really know what I'm looking for here. A muse, huh? I think I know what that means. I'll come by later. What? I just put on the tunes. I painted his canvas for him. Fish. Let's take a bath in his house. Don't. Wow, I don't actually need to use the toilet. There's a lot of fun little details. <laughs> it's fun to drop a deuce and not flush. You're the new guy that's gonna live here? Well, you seem nice enough. You must be confusing me with someone else. I'm really in some trouble. Hey, you, aren't you interested in living here with us? Who, me? I'm sorry, but I already have a place to live. Besides, you wouldn't want me living here with you guys. I'm not really a cool guy or anything. Aw, oh, man, too bad. You see, I have a little problem with my hands right now. I need to find someone to live here with us. But I don't know any nobody else in the city. Not even the neighbors. And the bad news is I'm out of money to pay the rent this month. So you get it? Unless I find someone to come with, live with us, I'm screwed. I see. You know what? I'm going to take a look around and see if I find someone that may need a... May, that would be in need of a house. Yo, what's up, Narcotis? Would you do that for me? Man, you're awesome. Don't worry, I'm not that nice of a guy, really, but I'll do what I can to help you. Hello? Hey man, this is a man-only place, so feel free to come anytime you want. You'll always be welcome here. But remember the rules, no women allowed. This is a sanctuary for us, a safe haven, our little kingdom. Okay, relax, buddy. Got a burger. Just like touching shit. Two giant lava lamps. Oh! <laughs> Picture of a pair of heroic boots. Either that or ooze containers from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh, right. Oh. Hello? Narcotis! Yo! Thank you, brother. Thank you so much for the resub. Thanks for supporting the channel, man. Really appreciate that. Damn. Oh, shit. <laughs> Dude, we're playing... Th this game we're playing right now is a... Is a uh, Pretty interesting 2K3 game. Do not train a child to learn by force or harshness, but direct them to what amuses their minds. Nice spread of Geno, so stoked it's getting rid of a master. Yeah, dude. It's my favorite game of all time. Oh, vacant. It's a scum. Just got some equipment in here. Okay. City at night. Betty's room. Hello? Last night killed me. I'm so tired. I should stop being a goth or go back to being a normal girl. But if I did that, my friends would stop hanging out with me. Maybe I should let things stay the way they are now. 
Hey, ma'am, we're planning a party at the Vlad Club this afternoon. You should go there. We prefer to go there because it is empty at this time, so we can have our fun without anyone bothering us, if you get what I mean. I don't. I don't feel so good. I may have drank too much blood this night at the cemetery. I should start taking it easy. Yeah, I think... I think all the blood eating is gonna probably... mess with your body a little bit. <laughs> but ding. silly goth girl bloods for vampires exactly well that was interesting as well most of these NPCs don't do anything they're just here I will tell you though that I have not figured out what the hell I'm supposed to be doing here. Just like regular RPGs. Yeah, Pokemon games have such useless, uh, such useless NPCs. I've been rewatching your playthrough of Looming Spire, and I have to tell you, it's been extremely motiva motivating for me to have something I can watch the time. Nice, dude. No, that makes me happy, man, because, like, I'm dumb. So, I will stumble through your game and help you find some stuff. <laughs> but, dude, it's coming along so great. Uh... And, and, you know, take all the time you need for it. Whoa. Shorts are comfy and easy to wear. Can I let the prisoners out? Why is the dog locked up? Why'd they lock the dog up, bro? Justice for the pooch. Canine culprit. That dog did nothing wrong. Psalm 11973. Thy hand have made me and fashioned me. Give me understanding that I learn thy commandments. Thanks. What up here, though? Oh, the club. Heard someone say something about a hidden laboratory that does experiments with human babies. Don't know more than that, sorry. You may- wait, what? Did you know that Mystery Falls was an old town that disappeared 20 years ago? Must have been a mega church. Yo, they're raising the roof for Jesus in here. Hello, what will it be today? Piece of pie is $120, but a gob pill, whatever the hell that is, is $600. What kind of a bar are you? Have you heard about the ghost manor that people are talking about? I think that is just an urban legend told to scare the kids. I miss being with my family. I'm working so much lately that I don't even remember their faces. Bro, this is not work. You were at the club. Psalm 106.17 The earth opened up, swallowed up Dathan, and covered the company of Abiram. Abiram. I don't know what the hell that means. I don't know what that means. So I'm gonna go downstairs because it's better. Yeah, this is real church. That's how real you really worship. <sighs> you raise the roof. This game's cool. I really like how ambitious is, uh, it is. It also is one of those RPG Maker 2K3 games that doesn't, because of the graphics and everything, it does not feel like a 2K3 game. I love that I could just poop in toilets. Oh, Mamma Mia. Uh oh. 
Hi, I'm Norman. I'm the chef of this very respected restaurant here in the city. What do you want with little shoulder chef Norman? Some nice food, maybe? Norman, I'm sorry, but are you related to Herman? Guess not. Should look like that. The text boxes are goofed up. This is fun in the sense that you, um, you know, explore this town. They need like a bike item or something so you can just get through it really quickly. The font's the only thing that gives it away, huh? I would agree. A skateboard maybe? That'd be so great. Oh. Do some skater die. I love that game. Wait, what? <laughs> okay. A scooter. Be wise and don't trust anyone that you met. Someone may just be planning and doing some kind of trap for you. I, those weren't words. You guys like TV? And have some magical professor telling you not to ride your skateboard indoors. Yo, they got a picture of Duck Hunt in there? Whoops. There's so many clubs. Would you like to play a game of dice? No. Shut up, kid. Let me just change the song on you. Party Town, truly. The investigation's going fine, sir. Aliens are walking around us. You're so luck. Come on, one more. Damn. You win something if you get three in a row. I have not. I'm over it. Let's play Escape the Police One. You're a fugitive because you haven't paid your house rent. Oh my god, don't get caught by the police. Come on, you idiots. You dumbass cops. You stupid idiots. Oh, shit. That's right. Morons. Oh, shit. What do you mean I can't jump off? No, oh, fuck. Come on, you idiots. Oh, fuck. I'm screwed. <gasps> nice. Nice! Nice! Stop right there. You're under arrest. Oh my, what is happening? Police business, come with us. Police is taking your girlfriend out as hostage. You need to find her and rescue her. Yeah, I hate this. I hate the cops. Yo, what's up, Tom? Tom, the cops kidnapped my girlfriend. Who are they protecting and serving? It ain't me. Oh shit. They did. I gotta play it again. Like, they're arresting me because I didn't pay my rent. The fuck? Why are they chasing me? 
It's just a bill. It's money isn't real, idiots. Got busted by a UFO. Yeah, what the hell? Okay, there's my girlfriend. And then they kidnap her. Okay, well, that sucks. Gotta do it again. I'm actually getting pretty good at it now. They're just making up laws now. Okay, here we go. What? Okay, that wasn't even fair. I'm over it. Tom, how you doing, buddy? Good morning to you. Super bogus. <laughs> this game's cool. I think after about 30 minutes, 30 or so minutes of wandering in it, I, I, I realize there's a whole lot of game here, which is like super impressive. It's, it's, it's really a cool project. Oh. What? Hey, Desmond, I have a side job here at the gallery. There's some rules. You get electrocuted if you hit any civilian. Okay, so you may shoot a civilian, but you will get electrocuted. What do I press? Oh. Getting through my email grind, just about to hit 11 now. I had a drop of coffee? You need some coffee. And I need to do some emails as well. Okay, don't hit the civilian. <laughs> okay. We're getting good at this, man. I don't know. I'm kind of a pro gamer at this point. Oh, that's a mother and child. <laughs> Shit's easy, dude. Easy game. Oh god. Shit. Damn it. <laughs> this mini game goes crazy. That it? Well done. Oh, is that it? Okay. <laughs> Train your fighting skills. Let's go. Oh, shit. Oh, this is cool. Okay. Yeah, I murder. I kicked, I kicked his ass so hard I killed him. Oh, he's still alive. Okay, okay. How come I can't use those skills like on the map, though? Kicked his butt into the shadow room. Alright, well, I think that's enough for us for today. We got a pretty good idea of what Deadly Woods is. Um, I might consider playing more of this because it's pretty fascinating. It's just really slow. I think being able to run or move a little faster might- Oh, you can get hit by cars. I love that, actually. I mean, in fact, I'm just going to keep walking on the road. Oh, the arcade. I guess I'll live another day. 
Is that Donkey Kong? Whoa! Oh. Playing Mega Man? Oh my god. What? How do I kill him? Okay. Oh, he, he what? Oh my god. Okay, that was good enough. Racing. It's bump and jump. Oh shit. All you gotta do is just stay in the middle. Hell yeah, this is pro gaming, dude. Honestly. I feel like a geriatric uh, gamer right now. Because this is moving so slow. Did I win? Oh shit, people. Okay, well. Bike racing. Oh, it's just the same thing but sideways. What's this one? Nothing. Driving Miss Crazy. They're literally calling me an old man. Kevin. Jotaro. Cujo. Servbot. Snake! Dolls kissing lovers. David Parker. Nice. Some references. It's just so fun to wander in here. Good day. Have you heard about the haunted manor that's hidden in the forest? People say that you can only get there by jumping on a moving train? Nothing, I still have no money. Lola. Where am I? No money, but free gotcha. Herman's room. A vacant room. They'll love that show. Fish. Cool. Alright. I think I've seen enough of this game at this point. It really gives me like, just like, yeah, like early PC or like Game Boy advanced game vibes especially with the music let's go let's die let's find out what happens when you die you know maybe
Oh, I'm not actually losing health. Not gonna save first? I saved. It's not actually damaging my health, so. They just bump you. What a game. Man, we're, this is such a cool find. What an interesting find of a game. But even deeper than I anticipated. Oh, that's Deadly Woods, baby. And boy, are they deadly. Basically just a Twin Peaks, huh? Like a Twin Peaks parody. <laughs> well, guys, I think that's it, man. I think I, I, I think we've played enough games today. How's that vibe for sure? Yeah, it felt really cool. It was a very neat project. Um, but uh, it just needs something to speed it up a little bit, and then it needs more direction. Just needs to tell you where the hell to go, right? But I don't know. I had fun. Um, thanks everybody for hanging out today. If you're new, uh, if you're new to the channel and and are you know, it's like rare that you hang out. Like, please come back. We will be doing more streams like this in in the future. But yeah, Shadow Mario, thanks for hanging, dude. Um, I think what we're gonna do now on Twitch is Rizade. Rosade out. Who's this? Oh. Thanks for being here. Um, yeah. Wow. Great track. I think we'll go to another RPG Maker guy. And uh, I hope everybody has a good one. Please show some love to this streamer. We got to support our own if you're an RPG maker, Dev. Um, but I appreciate y'all. Love you. Stay tuned. Bye. Oh, hi, Kiwi. Bye, Kiwi. <laughs>